live my life and, and create my artwork uh, more from intuition, a place of intuition rather than intellect. So uh, the reason doesn't come so much into play when creating artworks or making some of the big decisions of your life. It, for me, I've always gone to my heart or, or my intuition, which, which leads me. Uh, it's, it's actually never steered me in, in the wrong direction. Portraits are, are an extension of, of people, you know. So the portrait is the person and being interested in, in um, humans and, and uh, what they bring to life is sort of a natural for a photographer. Uh, many people work on it, you know. We have a, it's a big production, it's like a small film. And I'm, you know, directed and casted and we do the art direction and, you know, I start with drawings and do watercolors and then from there we, we start building sets and then I cast it and it's all for a reason. The concept drives the image and of course I like to say things with a sense of beauty and aesthetic. So for me it's a marriage of concept and, and, and aesthetics. Um, when people want to just make statements and they don't employ beauty, I find it difficult to look at and not that interesting. For, for me, beauty is a, a, a weapon in which to grab the viewer and then uh, communicate with them. But I don't like pornography, and I think that there's a fine line, and I think that you know a lot of the new pictures I'm doing are sort of, a, of an idea of reclaiming the nude from pornography and making, uh, making us take a look again at the, the body is not just a sum of its objects and it's not meant just to be objectified. I think now with the internet, the saturation of pornography has reached such a, um, almost a point of no return. The, the nude and, and our figures is, you know, part of the beauty of God and as in nature. So the idea of reclaiming the nude from the grips of pornography, from the dark ages of, of that type of thinking is, 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 a, is, a, is a goal I have in a small way. I would like to contribute to the idea of seeing the body again for what it really is. So I feel like if you're an artist, you have a choice. You can enlighten, you can try to clarify for yourself and for your viewer, or you can just add to the confusion. And I'd rather just try, at least attempt, for some clarification.